Welcome back. Now we want to make our first statistical uh, analysis of uh, our texts. We had uh, the library, the, these books here. Now I have 12. You might have a uh, different. So we check first. So we make a title of our new chapter in our book. So we uh, say statistics on characters. So what we have this global uh, uh, variable library that's here. So we had the book selection. This was the here the, our pop-up menu. Take this here. And this is with dynamic selected, so therefore we can have it here. And then we ask for book selected. It's hops. If we go to the card, this is the card working. Nice interface. So we can use this variable. And then we want to load the text in a fast way. So we had the timing here. This was the old one so we went to the source now we can go for the fast one so the internal thing so we have this book selected book selected this is our text and it's fast Bam. it's there great so First thing is we can, for example, say string take uh, text. Let's look it up. String take uh, gives a string containing the first n characters in string. So if we have, uh, for example, here text 1000, we get the first 1000 characters. Very nice. So we can have uh, from 1000 to 2000. Good. That's simple. So we have other functions here, string part, string drop, look it up. Operating on strings here is a kind of tutorial. So we have uh, string manipulation. Here these are all the commands on strings. Look them up get an overview and play a little around. So I will show you how it works with our thing. So string uh, links, for example. This is a count of, of uh, characters uh, if of text. 140,000, it's a short one. So <laughs> uh, take, for example, Montagne, import, Huh. Why is it not there? Not there. Uh -huh. You can I show now how to debug these things. I didn't check it carefully enough. Um, you can skip it or we, we can skip it. So, uh, this was done here and we don't have it on this list, but we have it on the list of the books. Check the list of the books, make a new books. Aha, uh -huh. it's not on this list. Why is it not on this list? Uh -huh. That's the problem. We put it wrongly here. Therefore, we simply have to do what we did here. Um, book selected. What is book selected? This should be Montagne. This is what we did with Leibniz. Works with a single book. And here we are. 
Good. Here we are. Fine. Forget it. So now, go for Montaigne. Get here. We are fast. String length here, 3 million. So that's a good book. So, what we can do, for example, we can say string uh, uh, position and we ask f uh, text and ask for all the A's. No, um, string uh, um, count count A. We have 180,000 A's. We can ask for A and uh, B. String count. Uh -huh. It's not working. Um, then we can say for a nature. This is where uh, this is uh, 500 times uh, nature. So that's good. Now string counts. Uh, character counts. Yeah, here, this is what I wanted to have. Text here. This is all the alphabet. So you see there's an association list and uh, the counts of each thing. So we are not interested in the special characters, for example. Let's continue with this example. Share counts is this. Um, go down. Now, for example, we can say um, character range from A to Z. Then we get this. Um, join this with same thing. So from A to Z. So we have two lists and join, bring them to one. Look it up, what it means. It's obvious. Now these are all the characters of importance. So if we have these share counts here, you see this an association and these are rules. So if I put and ask for E, then I get this number. If I ask for F, I get this number. Another right thing is that you can say E and apply the rules to this expression. So what I know, so we can have E, F, or F. So, and I can have this here and do the check counts. So, and then bar, no, bar chart of the previous output and this is a chart on the frequencies of characters in this text in the essays. Good. You see it's fine. Let's make a um, let's make a comprehensive function for that. So I always collect then this derivation of the function. So we had, we got the, the text. So we have these Ah, here this chair counts at this then we have the counts 
and we put that to about shot. of this. So this is a bot shot and here we are. So make that a function MTP book um, character frequencies and we say this is of a book name definition of the function, then we have to get the block of these uh, things here. Here we're missing a comma. So text is a variable and we have to save it from and shelter it. The same with share counts, so it doesn't disturb other programs. So, and now we have the book name here, and we put it here instead of selected. So, now this is our function. We put it to make it available. So, now we have, in a comp for a comprehensive way, we get uh, this Montagna, and we Put this function here and we put this here of book selected. Here we are with Montagna. Uh, if we go for lock, this is with lock, not much difference and we can make that dynamic but be careful with the dynamic. Uh, now it's Newton. Now it's Hobbes and uh, Leibniz. So simple, not too much to learn from that, but uh, how to deal uh, with these uh, strings and data and the, and the string data in the first lesson. Thanks for watching. I think, hope you found it interesting and see you in the next tutorial about statistics on words.